Hued Indie Horror. If you've seen the previous videos in this series, you already know what's up, but if you're new here, I think you're in for a treat. I am on a quest, a hunt, for the cutest indie horror game on Itch.io, and so far we have had a ton of bangers. And spoilers from the future, I think today's games are gonna be just as banging. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Ooh. Whoa, this is wild. What's that? Cookies? Oh, hell yeah. Give me them cookies. Is that going to be the entire point? Oh, oh, space to jump. Shift to fall faster? Shift to fall... Shift to fall fat. What? What? Oh, it's like a trampoline. Shift to fall. F oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I get it. I can't move at all. So I think I need to bounce and then fall and then bounce and then fall. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh, yeah. I'm getting closer. Ooh. Oh, oh. Uh, Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, fall speed is based on the height you start holding shift at. Oh, oh, so I gotta hold it at the, damn it. I gotta hold it at the peak of my jump. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, I messed it up. I was so close. I thought I was like out of orbit or something. Shift, shift, here we go. Oh, I had it too. The first try, the first try was so easy. And then I got held up because I thought I was, I thought I reached escape velocity or something. I thought I was out of this. Oh, I want those cookies. Oh, that's hard. Oh, I thought I had it. Oh, I get it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. For some reason, it's easier to look down. Here we go. Here we go. I'm coming for you, cookies. Come on. Jump. Why am I not going higher? Oh, I am going higher. Holy crap. Ooh, I looked down at the wrong time. Oh, come on. I'm at my height. Come on. So close. Come on. Please. Did I get it? Did I get it? Did I get it? Come on. Come on, cookie. Come on, I can get the cookies. Oh, the, the cookies keep going higher. Ooh, I'm so close. I'm not, I'm not even sure how high I am. I'm just, I'm so laser focused on these cookies. Come on. Come on, cookie. Cookie, cookie, cookie. Hell yeah. Oh no. <laughs> this game's great. <laughs> Come on. We're so close. We're so close. Ooh. See, I feel like the moon should be pulling me in at this point. All right. Holy crap. <laughs> Come on. Come on. There it is. one of the cookies <laughs> that was good that was so good i really liked that it was simple and it was surprisingly challenging it was kind of hard to get into the rhythm of it oh epilogue they faked me out i thought it was done epilogue welcome to the epilogue okay oh i can move this time jumps work as before Ooh. lateral movements kind of kind of this is pretty janky, so press R if you need to reset. Ooh, oh, okay. I'm gone. Is there an edge? Can I just keep going? What's out here? 
Hold escape to go- Oh my gosh. I'm not even moving the camera. That- That's all in the game. I want to know if there's an end to this. There are no secrets out here. Just a playful jar of cookies. I don't believe you. I'm gonna- I'm, I've got time. Follow me on itch for updates and new games. That- Oh god. I hope you don't get motion sickness. I'm not even touching anything anymore. I just It just keeps going. Um, as I was saying, I really enjoyed this game. It was surprisingly challenging for having only two buttons. Okay, I need to... I need to... That's in my periphery and it's messing me up. <laughs> that was good. I really enjoyed that. I definitely wasn't expecting it to get all trippy at the end like that, but that was a lot of fun. <laughs> I love the graphics quality settings on this. Nose? Eyebrows. <laughs> the next game on today's list is Uncle Panko's Terrible Little Farm. Options? Play. Just play, just play. I don't even know why I went to the options. <laughs> what do we got? Ooh. I already love the style. It's very cute. My dear nephew. Greetings, Stephen. It is I, your Uncle Panko. I hope you are well. Your parents tell me that you are soon to graduate. A fine achievement indeed, Quentin. It feels like just yesterday you could barely walk and talk, and now you're almost fully grown. How time flies. Looking back, it seems that I haven't actually seen you in person since then, and for that I apologize. I'm just so busy at the farm nowadays, which brings me to the point of this letter. I would like to invite you to spend the summer here with me. It would be nice to have some help and we could make up for all the lost time. If you would like to accept my offer, Jeremy, all you have to do is take the bus to the farthest stop at- Wait, I thought it was Quentin. Who's Jeremy? To the farthest stop at the outskirts of the next town over. Once you get there, just follow the dirt path cutting through the woods. My farm is just around the corner. Hope to see you soon. Uncle Ponka. Wait, but who's Jeremy? Je I thought I was Quentin. Oh, I love this. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm in control. I really like the art style. It looks almost hand drawn and then like the leaves almost look watercolor. That's really cool. Am I, what am I, what am I doing? I've already, I'm guessing I've gotten off the bus. This, this looks like a farm over here. So, okay, wait. Oh, this is a light post, okay. Oh, a trail. I, I guess the trail's probably where I should be going. Mm, this is cute. This is adorable. When's the turn? We all know there's gonna be a turn. This is this video after all. Michael, my boy. My boy? What? Who are all these people? <laughs> I'm glad that you decided to visit. Unfortunately, something expected came up, and I'll be gone for the first few days of your stay. Would you mind doing some work around the farm until I return? I know it's a lot to ask, since you'll be all by yourself, but if anyone can handle it, you can, Robert. <laughs> this is the fourth name you've called me, Uncle. <laughs> Do you even know who I am? <laughs> I've left a few more instructions around the house to help you, and I'll take the majority of the work again once I get back. The key to the front door is located under the little goblin on the porch, and your room is the one on the second floor. Make yourself at home, Uncle Ponko. Either Uncle re is really bad at names, or he doesn't know me at all. Oh, uh, oh. That's goblin. Okay, cool. I got a key. Did it. Oh, here we go. I'm still learning the controls. Did it ever tell me the controls? No. Oh, this is cute. Oh, okay. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, uh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, ooh, does it work? Does it work? Oh, I wanted it to work. Oh, okay, I can't seem to interact with anything in here. Uh, this door? Oh, that's back outside. I have a room on the second floor? Right. Okay, stairs. Cool. Uh, second floor, second floor, second floor. Beautiful. Um, is this my room or is it? that doesn't open? Uh, I mean, I guess it's the only one that, that opens. All right, cool. C close, close. All oh, right, it's like, all right, no privacy. Fine, fine, fine. Uh, hello, 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 hello. Okay, okay, um, hello. I'm here? Uncle, you didn't really tell me, y'all. 
what the plan was? You didn't tell me anything. You didn't tell me what needs to be taken care of. You just kind of, you just kind of said, you know, you'll figure it out. You'll get it. You got it, right? You know how to farm. I mean, I guess I just need to explore, right? 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 There was a barn out here, I think. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I think I can only get to the barn through the house. That is fair. Oh, a scythe. Okay, well, maybe there's a note somewhere. Oh, there is. Oh, I wanted it so bad. I wanted it so bad. Let's see. Lenny. <laughs> You'll get it one time. One of these days, uncle. I see you found the barn. The cows can be quite rowdy, especially on sa uh, Sundays, Thursdays, and the second Wednesday of every other month. So if you hear any odd sounds coming from inside, pay them no mind. I fed them and locked the door before I left, so they shouldn't bother you today. Tomorrow, however, I would like you to let them out to graze. The key to the barn door is hanging in the entryway of the house. Please leave it locked until the sun comes up tomorrow. And what if I don't? What if I don't? Oh, another door. Or another letter. Dearest nephew, apologies, but I forgot to mention something important. Life out in the wilderness can be a bit rougher than life in the suburbs, especially at night. Not all the time, but enough that some caution is warranted. So before the sun fully sets each day, I need to, you to go inside of the house and remain there until the sun rises again. Today, specifically, you need to make sure to shut and lock the back and front door in that order. Back, then, front, before going to bed as well. Uncle Panko. What if I don't? What happens? Oh, it won't even let me take the key. Oh, I did it out of order. God damn it. <laughs> Can I close this? Okay, whatever. Well, I did it out of order. Am I gonna die? Oh, hey there, bud. How'd you get up here? Huh, okay. Ronnie, <laughs> it seems you may have made a mistake during your nightly routine. That's alright, nobody's perfect. Unfortunately, that means one of them got inside of the house. This is fixable, but you need to follow these instructions exactly as I've written them. Take a red candle from your bedside drawer and light it. Then walk with it calmly to the downstairs bathroom and lock yourself in. There's a pillow and a blanket in the cabinet under the sink in case you need it. The bathtub isn't exactly the most comfortable place to sleep in the house, but it's better than the alternative. Uncle Panko. Is this my uncle? Is that gonna be the twist that this is my uncle and that's why he can't physically be here? Okay, so I've got a red candle. Right, it was red? <laughs> you can go back in time. I can't I can't go back in time right now to figure out what it was. Boingy, boingy. Who? Can I just stay in my room? Okay. Uh, lock, lock, lock myself in the bathroom. Right. There was a blank. Oh, oh God. Okay. Ho. Oh, ho. Oh, ho. Oh, oh, ho. Oh, ho. God. Okay. All right. Um. I have already forgotten what I need to do. <laughs> what was I supposed to do? Where did it, did the candle need to go? Okay, well, I guess. Good morning. Good morning. All right. Am I okay, Uncle? Oh, those stairs were longer. I was gonna say something about that, but then uh, there were other. Okay, the gnome's gone. There were other pressing matters. Well, I'm supposed to- oh wait, I need the key, right? I'm supposed to let the, uh, cows out of the barn? No, well, there's no new notes, so I don't think I'm dead. Oh, hey! Hey there! Look at you! You're all so cute! I love the art style of this game. Was I supposed to- do anything? Oh no! Hey! Hey, hey, you need to get back inside! No, 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 no. Okay, can I close this? Oh, you you need to get back inside. Come on, come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Uh this isn't good. Uh, Uncle, I'm I'm I might lose one of your cows here. 
What if I come from this side? Oh, okay. I can't outsmart it. See, if you could just phase right through me, how am I gonna... Where'd he go? Uh... Wh oh, wait, wh what? <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> What are you doing? Oh, what was that? Are, are you following me? There you are. Okay, I think you're following me at this point. I think I think you're following me. Are you still following me? What is that? Oh, I'm not a fan of you. Cow, cow, can you just... Do I need to take you through the front door? Is that what's happening? Can I take you in through the... the there you are. No? How do I- how do I get you back in? There you are. It's so- <laughs> It's so disorienting. As soon as you move, no matter what direction, he's behind you. How do I get you- uh, how, <laughs> I'm just trying to- I'm just trying to see it. <laughs> how do I get you back in? Oh. Cool, all right. Crisis averted. Uncle does not have to be mad at me. There's a new note. Where are these notes coming from, Uncle? Moggy. Cool. If you're reading this, you're probably doing well. I'm very proud. Besides caring for their livestock, I'd like you to harvest some of my crops today. The purple stuff to be The purple stuff to be specific. Grab the sickle next to the gate and get started whenever you're ready. Make sure to keep an eye on your surroundings while you're harvesting. The field is small, it's more like a patch than anything else, but some little rascals still tend to hide in there when the crops are at their tallest. Don't worry too much about it, just stay on your toes and you'll do fine. I mean, I am technically still fine. After all the stuff that's been happening, I am still fine. Alright, wait, let me, there's one, two, three, four, five cows. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Oh, uh, how do I... Do I, do, uncle, do I need to harvest all of these? It's a lot. I hope it's okay that I'm just kind of ripping all of them out of the ground. Aye. He wasn't very specific with his instruction. Uh, oh, hey there, buddy. You got in the house last night. Did I die? What? What? What happened? No. No, no, no. You're not going to make me do all of that all over again, are you? Oh, okay. Yes, Uncle, I read your letter. It actually wasn't too bad. It didn't take me that long to get back. Okay, so what do I need to do to not die? Do I just need to not get close to you? Is that the answer? No, I died! Okay, let's really read this note again. Moggy, okay. Just stay on your toes and you'll do fine. Oh, hey! Hey, hey, hey! You're still here. Oh, I have to... Oh, no! Oh, hey! Okay, I need to approach them! See, I was trying to avoid them! Okay... I see you, game. I've almost got this. So close. Uncle, I'm gonna do you proud. I've almost got all of your purple stuff, whatever the purple stuff is. You didn't really tell me, but you're not very specific about many things. I'm still pretty convinced that your uncle, though. Okay, I'm done. I did it. Christopher. <laughs> <laughs> now he's just making names up. Uh, thank you again for doing all of this while I'm gone. I promise you won't have to spend your whole summer here just doing work around the farm. Why don't you herd the cows back into the barn and take the rest of the day off? Just ring the chimes next to the barn doors three times exactly, and they'll take it from there. After that, you can head on back to the house. Okay, three times exactly. Three times exactly. Everything is very specific. You gotta follow the rules with uncle. One, two, three. No more. All right, cool. Cool, I did it. Uh, can I like watch TV or something? I didn't press anything. It just kinda. O okay, cool. Let's see, rise and shine. 
You didn't even give me your name this time. Today you're going to meet my chickens, or rather my chickens' eggs. They should have laid a good amount of them by now, and you I'd like you to go out to the coop and gather them. There's a basket on the kitchen counter you can use to hold them. Just put it back where you found it when you're done. Oh, one more thing. Of course, there's always a twist. Nothing can be simple, Uncle. Chickens make easy prey for some of the local wildlife, and their eggs are even easier. So stay on your guard, and don't let anything sneak up on you while you're distracted gathering eggs. But most importantly, have fun! Maybe farming, maybe, maybe farming's not for me. Maybe I should be on my way back home. Um... Oh, hey there. Did you bring, did you bring me this? Oh, I appreciate you. I've already forgotten what uncle wanted me to do. All I know is chickens have predators and... Hey there! Alright. Oh, uh, what? Oh! 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 Get the eggs! Get the eggs! Get the eggs! Whoa. Okay. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Am I done? I think I... Was that it? Oh! Cool! I love how these notes are so well planned, they're always where you're gonna be looking. This is so good! This game is so- My boy! <laughs> He's really giving up on names now! Thank you again for helping me out around the farm. I know it might not exactly be fun, especially not by yourself, but I hope you might grow to love this land as I have. Anyway, I think you've done everything important for now, I think. Feel free to spend the rest of the day as you wish, just head to bed whenever you get tired. I'm sure I didn't forget anything. Great, great, great. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I'm real confident, Uncle. Thank you, thank you. Real confident. Can I just, like, watch TV? I can't go out that way. Oh, oh, okay. I mean, I can't really go anywhere, so I guess you forgot nothing. All right, cool. Unless I can open these all of a sudden, which I can't. All right, bedtime it is. Cool, yeah, cool. It's a hard day's work. I got some eggs. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel good. I feel good. I feel good about what I've done today. Oh, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I love waking up in the middle of the night. Ooh, uncle's not here to, to protect me this time. Cool, 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 cool. All right. Oh, the stairs were normal this time. Except this doesn't look like uncle's house. Oh yeah, it does, yeah, it does, yeah, it does. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does? No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Everything looks different at night, you know this. You know when you're driving and you're like, oh, I don't feel like I've been here before, and then you're like, oh, wait, I have. It's just nighttime. It's it's that all over again. Uh, where do I... Is this door always here? What? Oh, I hear the static. Oh, hey! Hi there! Welcome! I didn't close the door. I don't know if that was just slamming on... Nephew, I think I've got to mention something. I've never forgotten before. The goblin that you took the house key from when you first arrived? There's a non-zero chance that it might have been replaced by a gnome. And if you took the key from it, you will have effectively invited it into the house to stay. I don't own any gnomes, but one of my neighbors does, and it doesn't like to share. I won't sugarcoat it, you're in serious trouble. By the time you finish reading this note, I reckon you'll have about one minute to find the gnome in the house and give it back before its owner gets inside to take it. Check everywhere you can think of, around corners, inside cabinets, everywhere. It could be hiding anywhere. Once you find it, just open the front door and throw it outside. Literally, just throw the thing out. Uncle Panko. Okay, cool. So that wasn't you. I, 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 okay, cool. um, oh god. Oh god, okay. About a minute, huh? That's not, um... Okay, that door's locked. About a minute is not the most... Oh, there you are, there you are, there you are. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! You gotta get out of here. I am so sorry I didn't mean to take you. Okay, go. <laughs> is it over? Did I do it? Are these doors ever going to open? There's no notes. Oh, hey! Uncle! 
<laughs> you weren't a gnome. I thought you were a gnome this whole time. I'm very sorry. But to be fair, to be fair, you didn't know my name. You called me like five different names. So <laughs> there's my favorite nephew. How great to finally see you after all this time. You're quite a bit shorter than I remembered. I'm sorry I was gone for so long. I hope you weren't too bored here all by yourself. Hmm? Notes? Chores? Weird creatures from the fields and the forest? Why, I'm certain I only sent you one letter and left one note on the front door before you arrived. You must have had a nightmare of some kind, and I don't blame you. It can be a little scary out here sometimes, especially on your own. Well, you won't have to worry about that anymore. How about I make us breakfast, and then I'll give you the grand tour of the property. I hope you're ready for a summer of fun. Ending 2. Summer of fun. Ending two? Oh, there's another ending. Does the ending involve finding out who did leave the letters? Or maybe there is a goblin somewhere around here. No, I don't see a goblin. Well, I guess the biggest lesson of this game is follow uncle's directions. Remember them, remember them well, because your note's not gonna exist anymore after you've read it. It's like the one in Burn Notice where it just explodes when it's done. <laughs> I think that I think that happens at Burn Notice. I've never I've never actually seen it. Anyway, apparently there's another ending at least. So if you want to see that for yourself, there's gonna be a link to this game down below. Well, this was a really fun game, and I've loved the art, and it was surprisingly scary at times, and I think it was because those things stuck out so much against the background, making it just that much scarier. Moving on. And the last game on today's list is called Borb. I know literally nothing about it. I saw this face and I was like, that's pretty cute. I think this is going to fit right in. The land has been plunged into darkness. No one knows why or how. What was once familiar and comforting is now uncanny and cold. It is believed the source of the darkness comes from an ominous stronghold. You were tasked with entering this labyrinth of depths to seek out some solution to the oppressing darkness that consumes the land. After hours of searching, you feel you are close to the end. However, you are now lost, and the way ahead is darker than ever. Will you be able to save the land from the darkness? Ooh, there is lore here? There is a story? There's a backstory? Shake Borb is F. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's, let's do it. Let's do it. Shake Bob is F. Why would I need to shake... Bob? Ooh. Uh, Sprint doesn't really do a whole lot for you. I like how it zooms out a tiny bit. It even like has a little bit of a lens distortion going on. That's cool. That's a really cool effect. All of these games tonight have... What just happened? Did the room change? I'm gonna just stand back here for a minute. The games tonight have all had really awesome styles. They have... Is it getting closer? Oh, it's a shadow, okay. As I was saying, the games tonight have all had incredible stylings, incredible atmosphere. They picked a style, they picked a vibe, and they stuck with it, and I really, really appreciate these games for that. It's, it's a shadow. Oh. Wow. Good job. That was really scary. That was... That actually induced a lot of anxiety. Wow. I still don't know why I need to shake. Oh, hey. Hello. You look like... You were on the cover. You're so cute. Look at you. Oh, hello. My name is Blight the Orb. But you can call me Borb. Are you lost? The dark sure can be scary. Wade, are you trying to vanquish the darkness? Oh, ooh, let me help. Take me with. I can protect you from the horrors of the dark, and if you bring me to the inner sanctum, I can use it to spread my light across the realm. What was that about your name being Blight? Go ahead, pick me up. Oh, I can't say no to that face. Oh, yeah, we'll spread your light. But your name is Blight. Hmm. I feel like that should be a red sign. 
There is a powerful darkness ahead that will drain my light. I don't see it draining. If my light goes out, the monsters will know your location and come after you fast. Okay. Just shake me to recharge my light and make the monsters disappear. Cool. Alright, cool. I, I mean, I made it to the light. Seems like if we have to enable two light locks, look for the light. Okay, I still didn't. But how do I know if I'm shaking you? Oh. I can't shake you until you go out. Is that it? Okay. Ooh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm charging. I'm charging. Oh my god. Okay. Oh god. Goodbye, music. <laughs> that was so abrupt. Oh man. Ooh. Some whiplash here. Oop. Go, 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 go. Come on, Barb. Orb, come on! I need you. I need you. I don't even know. Oh, <laughs> it's so quick. It's so quick to change. I mean, the music is perfect. It's instant anxiety. Borb, come on! Borb, come on! Borb, 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 borb. Come on! Oh my God! It feels like it takes longer every time too. Is this it? Is this it? Did I find it? That is one. Isn't my light less scary? I mean. Yes? Borb, I'm still not convinced you're the good guy. Okay. Oh god. Oh my god. Okay. 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 We're moving. We're moving. We're going. We're going. We're going. Come on, Borb. 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 You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. Turn on. Come on. They're completely gone when you're on. Holy cow. Okay. Come on, Borb. Come on. Come on. Come on. Work for me, Borb. Work for me. Go. This is, this is actually incredible. <laughs> I love, I absolutely love how quickly the vibe changes. It turns out all it takes is some suspenseful music to, to make you anxious in a video game. What was that noise? Hmm. Oh, Borb, I'm sorry. Hang on, hang on. Oh, the noise was the doors behind me. Cool. Come on, Borb, hurry up. Oh my god, Borb. Okay, come on. Come on, Borb. Come on, Borb. Come on, Borb. Come on. Come on. You're my friend, right? Come on. Oh my god. Oh. I don't know why it's so stressful. Nope, Borb. You gotta. You gotta work with me, Borb. You gotta. Did it. That's the second. I'm so excited. Once my light is spread across the land, things will be better. Again, your name is Blight. I'm not super convinced that you are the good guy. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> you know I can't say no to that. Alright, just gotta get back. That's all it takes. Oh, it's in the room, it's in the room. I hear it, I hear it, I hear it. Come on, Borb. Come on, Borb. Come on, Borb. Come on, Borb. My hand's getting tired, Borb. We gotta, we gotta move. We gotta get out of here. Oh my god. Come on, Borb. I mean, we're in the light now. Awesome. Just gotta, just gotta breathe for a second. I just gotta breathe for a second. <laughs> this is great. Cool. We get, we're, we are getting closer to the inner sanctum. Soon my light can replace this horrible darkness. So I think I'm starting to put this... Be careful, the darkness here is very powerful, it will play tricks on you. So... I can't help but notice that the monsters only exist in the dark. And if we spread your light, are they gonna... Hey, what's with that face? What? What? What is this face? What is happening? Borb? Borb, what's wrong? No, I'm, I'm not turning around. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna turn around for you. No, thank you. Borb, can you, can you provide me a little bit of light? I feel a little bit better. Borb, please. I just want some light. <laughs> Oh my god. Hey, there's some light. What's that? I don't know that I want to go near that. Borb, come on. 
You just gotta turn on, Borb. Oh, okay, we're going. Borb, you look a little different now. A little more realistic. We're just gonna go. We're just gonna go, though. It's okay, Borb. Where's that door? Um, um, to the right. It's open. It's open. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. I don't know what's behind me. I don't wanna know what's behind me. Why is the music getting louder? Why is it getting higher? Oh, I could. I thought it was a dead end. We're good. We're good. We're good. We just gotta keep moving, right? Oh, but Borb! Oh, hey! Cool! Oh, there's so many of you! Oh, Borb, you, you, you too, huh? Oh! Yay, the inner sanctum is right up ahead! Borb, I've been going through a lot today. <laughs> we just... <laughs> uh... Finally, the scary darkness will be replaced by my comforting light. Borb, do I want to put you here? Are you going to turn out to be evil? Are you going to cause problems? We made it! Time to spread my light across the land. Okay. Oh, boy. That is bright. Oh my god. Thank you. Now no one will be scared again. Oh my god, Borb. <laughs> I wasn't expecting biblically accurate angels. Come bask in the light of my angels. Borb, I hate it. <laughs> I was not expecting it to go there. A short horror game originally made in under a month for the for a game jam with the theme darkness and light. <laughs> that was good. That was so good. And it was simultaneously hilarious and so stressful to have the music kick in and then just cut out so fast like that. Stress! Relief. Stress! <laughs> it was so good. <laughs> and the ending. That was an ending. I don't know that Borb was the good guy, but I don't not know that. And look at that face, come on. Oh, these were all really fun, really interesting, really style forward games. And I loved all of them. If you wanna try any of these out for yourself, I'm gonna leave links down to all of them in the description below. And while you're down there, you can always hit that subscribe button too. If, if, you, liked, if you liked the video, that is. I'm not gonna make you do anything. If you like cute indie horror as much as I do, I'm gonna leave a link here to my previous video in this series. But until next time, have a good night.